we're testing using 26, the 2016 Robot and 3D Robot, um, which had a pneumatic catapult. We're using that catapult to test launching the milk crate, just to get an idea of the type of forces which are going to be required to launch if, for a potential catapult mechanism for this year. Perfect. Here, I'm pretty sure it's... Okay, that's going to go into your face. That one was actually kind of strong. That was better. No, uh, it, it was higher than that. The art was like over here. Yeah. Let's try that one more time. It's giving us, but... Yeah, so it wasn't... It was, you caught it, it before was, it even popped I caught off. it. Before it even popped off. No, it was like right at the peak, right I'm pretty sure. Yeah. yeah. I, I caught it higher than that, but what, it, it's like something like this. How far, how high is that? Can you get a measure? Three, two, one. That time the bottom was like here. Yeah, no, so. The top was at least here. Yeah, yeah, the bottom was like at this mark. So that's so actually, what, this mark is, is that six foot mark. So the top probably just cleared seven. Okay. So. so we're cool. So we have a crate like to go. That's doable. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, I mean, this is a short robot. You could literally raise it up. <laughs> okay, so the test we just did showed that the crate, just with Percy's, can be launched high enough and far enough that a catapult mechanism will be reasonable on this year's bot.